Hey. <laughs> Hi guys. <clears throat> we're gonna kind of well, I'm not sure if it's a tag. We're gonna pretend it's a tag. Yeah, we're making up our own tag, or we're not, and we're stealing someone's idea without realising. Yeah. We both live with our partners now and... And we used to live together. Yes, so we've got an idea of kind of what we like to live with. Yeah, and so we're going to answer some questions and you can find out what we like to live with and judge us. Yes. While we judge each other. Do you have any habits? Disgusting habits or like annoying habits or, you know, like... Oh, I will use a cup and then I'll be like, mm, I'll get another cup. I'll just look at it and be like, mm, I don't know now. But you've just washed the cup, surely? No, I would have used the cup, and then I'm like, oh, it looks a bit weird, even though I just drank a drink. What? Out you of it. won't drink out the same cup you just drank out, well, of, and then you'll get another cup. I might do, but then especially if it's a bit of tea, I'm like, oh, there's a little bit of milk that's been out there for ages. Ooh. Like, yeah, I'm a bit weird. I'm not about even stuff surprised like that. about that because Amelia's always like that. I have to look really closely at the cups I give her, like the mugs, uh, before I give her a drink in them because if they've got like a tea stain around them or something, she'll look at it and be like, mm, not sure about that. Can I have another cup? Another really bad habit is I go through a lot of washing up liquid and a lot of soap so and expensive. a lot of body wash. I know for a fact because when they've had a shower at ours, have you had a shower at ours or is it just yeah. Pete? I think. There's a lot of oh. shower gel that's been used when they stayed at ours. It's not, it's not Pete, it's me. Really? Yeah, because Pete, he puts a little bit and lathers it up, but I'm like, meh, meh. It's really bad. They're my bad habits. What are your bad habits? Um, I have a really, I don't think it's that bad at all, but Ryan gets really annoyed about it, is that if I'm on my laptop or I'm on my phone, when I finish with it, I kind of just like shove it down the side of the sofa, like my whole laptop. It's for, like, oh, I sometimes do that. For, like easy access, because <laughs> then it's not on the sofa so no one's going to sit on it, but I shove it down the side and then it's easy to access when I need it. And Ryan gets really annoyed about it. Every time he sits on the sofa, he's like, oh, why is that there? And then moves it somewhere. <laughs> Or I sometimes shove my laptop underneath the sofa. Oh, I do if that. Someone as well. comes in, and Ryan gets really annoyed about that because if we're moving the sofa or something, sometimes it can get knocked. Oh, and... I lose it, and then I'm like, where has it gone? It's under the sofa. Maybe I should have Ryan in this video because I feel like there's probably some other ones, but I don't know about. <laughs> I leave tissue, so it doesn't really happen at the moment in winter, but when it's like summer, I get on spring, I get really bad hay fever. And when I lived with my parents when they had Willow. Hmm. I was really allergic to her, so I would always have tissues. It was like, I'll go, f like, we'd go through them all the time with the family, mm -hmm. wouldn't we? Because Henry was obviously allergic, my mum was allergic. And I would, and I still do in the summer and spring, always leave tissues in my clothing. And then when we put them in the washing machine or tum like tumble dryer, uh, they go everywhere. Yeah. And it gets stuck to everything, and it's like stuck to Ryan's black jeans, and, and that, that's pretty annoying. Who does the cleaning? So I would say I do most cleaning, Pete probably does most tidying. Okay. So I am a very, I think I'm quite clean. I really enjoy cleaning. I hate tidying, so like I love cleaning the hob, I love cleaning the sides. For now. I don't mind cleaning <laughs> the bathroom. Uh, I don't mind hoovering. I don't mind little bits like that. I hate tidying. Yeah. I'm really bad at tidying. Ryan does way more cleaning and tidying than me. I mean, way more. There's like certain jobs that he literally does. He always changes the bedding. I really, I've never changed the bedding since I've lived with him. No, never ever. To be fair to myself, it takes me forever I mean, it's to quite do hard. it. I mean, it's quite it literally hard. takes me forever. Obviously, I say I haven't changed the bedding since I've lived with him, but I obviously changed bedding when I lived like with my parents, and it takes me forever. Whereas Ryan, he's so quick at it. So I it's do just hate easier. it. I get all hot and bothered. And yeah. Um, so yeah, so Ryan's always done that, but then there's things that I do, like, I, I do that Ryan doesn't really like to do, so like, I hoover our stairs, which I say hoover our stairs, it's a really gross carpet that we haven't changed, that the people won't had beforehand, and they had a cat, and so... Imagine if they're watching I think, this video and they're like, oh, mittens! Well, I think their cat must have, like, scraped on <laughs> you know what I'm on about. It's a really weird carpet, and so weird. it doesn't hoover up everything, so, like, dirt just gets stuck to it, and I literally have to, like... Have you tried one of those... Those little shaky things. You no, know, I've used you... Juno's hairbrush. Oh my gosh. Because obviously she's poodle, so it's like really fine. And have to actually scrape all the like hair and stuff and the dirt off the stairs and then hoover it. So it's a really long job. But that's one that I usually do quite a lot. And that's the only job I do. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's some jobs that... It's not, it's not, I promise. There is some jobs that I don't do that Pete only does. Um, I'm trying to think. <laughs> Who does more of the cooking? 
Me. I do more cooking. Okay. Ryan used to do more of the cooking, but I've really started. So when really? we first moved in, I quite liked the fact that I had some time while Ryan was coming home or something to like experiment and learn to do things. And then I kind of lost my confidence again because Ryan's a really, really good cook. So I get so worried that my cooking won't be as good. And obviously he's lived, I mean, he's cooked for himself since he was like 16 or something. Yeah. Whereas I, or 17 or whatever, whereas I haven't. So yeah, so but but recently I've been learning um, more and more it's to really like, cook nice, new things, it? and I really enjoy it when I'm given my space. I I'm usually not on a tell, time limit. As yeah, well. I usually tell Ryan like, "Can you get out of the kitchen?" Because I don't want you to like judge me for the things I'm doing. Yeah, no, I I do most of the cooking. Me and Pete, we're both not exper- like very uh, experienced cooks. Um, Pete more so, I'm gonna say. So <laughs> it's it's really good because we make sure that he does cook meals because. I don't want it to be like just me cooking no. sort of thing. But I do enjoy cooking and to be honest I don't mind like I actually find it quite nice. Who does the food shopping? I do the food shopping. Do you actually? Um yeah, we try to it's thing is we had this agreement we do it on Sundays. Everybody does their food shopping on yeah, Sundays. Yeah, we do ours on Sunday. Um and then we were gonna do Saturdays. But Although we use the little thing, you know, the thing you walk around and beep. Oh the, the beep because then you skip all the cues. You skip all the cues. The quick check. That is quite good. And to be honest, it's just so happened that we've been doing it on Mondays, mm. and I've just been doing it. I guess that's the beauty of being self-employed and like... Yeah, but I don't... It's not like expected that I do it, it's just like it's... We've been quite busy on our weekends. But surely if you don't do it on Monday, then you're kind of in some trouble. Well, if we don't do it on a Monday, then we're just ending up like buying food for the day, oh, and right. it just ends up being expensive. Yeah, definitely. So... Yeah, I think we are going to try and do Saturday mornings, because is that what you guys do? Yeah, sometimes we do Saturday mornings, but recently we have been doing Sundays, because we've been so busy during the weekend. This is literally it. We've been so busy. I do find that if we leave it till last minute on Sunday, we're usually quite tired. And and we just don't want to. Well, we don't end up doing a whole weekly food Mm. shop that way. Um, But we go food shopping together. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I think me and Pete, we're we're probably gonna we're still trying to get into the flow of that one. Do you have a budget? Yes. Yeah. Yes. We do too. Can't we, say we always stick to it. But, no, neither. Um, Ryan makes a joke that if you don't buy be, alcohol, it's fine. Yeah. Ryan makes a joke that he'd be able to stick to it if it wasn't me that came with him, <laughs> which is probably true. But that's because I always think about what I'm having for lunch. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, you comment down below who you think might be the easiest to live with, and hopefully we'll see you next week. Yeah. Amelia's going on holiday, I'm so going on holiday. there'll be a fun weekly vlog. You should be on holiday when you watch this. Yeah. So there'll be a fun weekly vlog hopefully coming soon. Hopefully. What. Well, there should be. Well, I don't, I don't want to jinx anything. There will be. Thank you very much, guys. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.